Yo, what's good everyone, man? So in today's video, I'm going to show you guys how to get the white joggers and the black duffel bag in GTA 5 completely solo but before we do continue on with today's video man shout out to these absolute legends for simply subscribing to the channel but let's not waste any more time and get straight into today's video and this video is completely for educational and entertainment purposes only let's get straight to it so to go ahead and start off with this white joggers method what you guys will need to do is you want to make your way to any clothing store on the map and you guys simply want to delete all of your outfits as this method does require us to do the transfer glitch which does require you to delete all your outfits or it basically deletes your outfits for you because that is just how the glitch works so you guys want to wear the one outfit you guys don't want to lose which i recommend you guys doing because then you guys can resave it after we do this method so as you guys can see i'm just going to wear this green jogger outfit right here because i'm not trying to lose this one i mean i don't really mind but might as well just wear it now once you guys have done this you guys want to press your pause menu Go ahead and go to swap character and once you guys are now in swap character right now what you guys simply want to do is you want to make sure your female character is on the left side and your male character is on the right side now keep in mind that this method only works for the female character anyways though once you guys have now got this all sorted you guys want to load into gta on your second character and it, your second character should be a male character so as you guys can see just like this go ahead and load into gta online just swap the rank over press you know accept the alert for that all that sort of stuff so you should be on a fresh male character on it that is in your second slot anyways once you guys are in a gta lobby you might see that there are no clothing stores on the map or in order to fix that all you have to do is just find a new session but for some reason the clothing stores popped up straight away for me so i just went over to the clothing store simple as that anyways though once you guys have made your way over to a clothing store you guys want to go ahead and take off your jacket and your shoes and any accessory you guys have on even a t-shirt or anything like that as you guys can see now once you guys have taken off all these clothing items you simply want to go to the pants section go to shorts and go to number 36 and equip these tan striped boxer shorts as you guys can see right here so once you guys do equip these tan striped boxer shorts all you guys want to do is walk up to the counter or just save the outfit in any slot and you just walk up to the counter save the outfit in any slot just like this you can save in slot one slot whatever 15 doesn't even matter anywhere you guys want now once you guys have done this you simply want to press your pause menu go to online go down to options and select the easy way out now i don't know if i can say what it says on youtube so you know you know just select the same alert as me and once you guys have done that you guys want to press your pause menu go to online and go to creator and once you guys have now loaded into creator you guys want to click on create a race click on tutorial accept the alert now press your pause menu go to online and go to choose character now we're basically just about done with the glitch so this is very easy method to do now if you guys are thinking this method is crazy bro it's not crazy it's honestly super easy so what you guys want to do from now when you guys have now loaded into that choose character we're back in this character selection menu you want to delete the male character that we were just on so press square or x or whatever you guys are on whatever console you guys are on delete that male character then you guys want to just type delete to confirm and then confirm it once your male character has been deleted you want to hover over your female character that we that is the main character and you guys just want to return to gta 5 story mode now if you guys cannot do this let's say you're on the next gen version of gta it's gonna say return to the main menu now instead of returning to the main menu if you are on the next gen version of gta you need to do a little bit of a different method what you need to do is you guys want to get a friend that is in a different targeting mode and then you guys want to join him accept the first alert and it should kick you guys into story mode by doing that anyways though once you guys have gone ahead and done that you guys simply want to go ahead and when you guys are in story mode you want to make a invite only session or a friend session public session doesn't matter just load into gta online basically now if you guys were a bit confused what i just said before if you're on the old gen version of gta so let's say you're on the ps4 version of gta 
for Xbox One or whatever. All you need to do is return to story mode. But if you guys are on the PS5 version of GTA or the Xbox Series S or X or whatever, you know, the newer version of GTA, E and E, whatever it's called, you guys simply want to just go ahead and do that method I told you. Join a friend in a targeting mode, accept the first alert, and it should kick you guys into story mode. Anyways, though, once you guys are now in a GTA Online lobby, make your way back over to a clothing store, or you can just open your interaction menu and go to your outfit section or your outfit style thing, whatever it is. And you guys will see you have white joggers. But yeah, as you guys can see, we now have white joggers. And make sure you do save your outfit that we are wearing. Because obviously, if we select the white joggers, the outfit we're wearing, we're wearing right now is just going to get lost and gone forever, basically. Anyways, though, that is how you guys get the white joggers, man. It's super simple. But to start off with this method, what you guys want to do is you guys simply want to come to this V on the map. And it is the Vincent missions. Now, you guys want to be wearing the outfit that you want to put the black duffel bag on beforehand. And yeah, as you guys can see, I've put this purple outfit on right here. Now, you guys want to walk into this yellow circle and go ahead and press right D-pad. Now, you will need to complete the first two missions until you get up to the mission called Concealed Weapons. And yeah, it's a setup mission and it's called Concealed Weapons for Vincent. Anyways, once you guys load in, go ahead and start it up by yourself. And this method literally takes like two minutes to do it's the quickest way to get a duffel bag in gta 5 and it's a complete legit method and it's very easy to do as you guys can see we've loaded into the mission now you guys now have the black duffel bag on your back now what you guys want to do from here is open your interaction menu go to appearance and then find illuminated clothing once you guys have found illuminated clothing you want to hold right d-pad on this or just scroll through it for about 20 to 30 seconds once you guys have scrolled through this for about 20 to 30 seconds go ahead and pull up your phone and just quit the job anyways once you guys load back into online you guys will see the black duffel bag is now on your back if the black duffel bag doesn't show up or it does show up and then it disappears for you uh, disappears after a few seconds what you guys want to do is register as a ceo or an mc then go to your interaction menu go to the mc or ceo style but once to the right then back to the left and then go ahead and back out and then the duffel bag will reappear but if that doesn't even happen for you you guys will just have the duffel bag on your back and you're all good to go anyways though once you guys have the duffel bag on your back it's not all done yet we need to do the saving method for this now what you want to do is you do need a flying vehicle and you need to make your way over to the beach now this is the only way you can save the duffel bag you can't just walk into a clothing store and try and save it that way it's just not going to work but you guys want to go ahead and parachute down towards the mask door and your character should land just like this and as you guys can see when your character is getting up you guys want to spam right on the d-pad to enter the mask door shelf and once you guys do that if you time it right it's going to allow you to enter the shelf just like this so there's basically a little gap before your character fully takes the parachute off and the duffel bag spawns on your back there's a little gap in between those two where you guys can enter the shelf and then go ahead and just save the outfit in any slot and then back out and then go to your interaction menu and re-equip that same outfit and you guys will see you'll have the duffel bag on your outfit and it's literally as simple as that and this is probably one of the best duffel bags in gta because you can change your outfits when you have it on the other black duffel bag isn't really the same if you have it on your back it's not going to let you change your outfits and all this sort of crazy stuff but yes yeah, it's honestly the easiest method to get the black duffel bag in gta and hopefully you guys did enjoy and if you did man drop a like drop a sub we're on the road to 100k subs and yeah once again this video is completely for educational purposes only and this isn't even a glitch in the game it's just a normal method anyone can get this duffel bag and it's very easy to do so that's how you guys do it and that's, yeah it's as simple as that man appreciate you guys bro let's get it